using the story info window. In this lesson, you will continue setting up your project by exploring the story info window. You will learn how to add key information about your project, such as genre, setting, source references, and more. You will also learn how to import images into your project for the big picture and key relationship threads in your story. Create a new project in Dramatica Story Expert using the File New command, or continue with the Hansel and Gretel project created in the earlier tutorials. This should leave you in the Project Overview window. Click on the Story Info icon or select the Project Story Info menu command. This switches you to the Story Info window. The Story Info window lets you add a variety of information about your story and the project in general. If you are following the tutorials, you'll notice the story title and author carry over from the Project Overview window. If not, replace your story with the title Hansel and Gretel in Hollywood. Press Tab to move to the Author text field and type Yours Truly if it's not already there. Press Tab to move to the Period text field. The period describes when this story takes place. It can be general, such as the late 30s, or specific, such as New Year's Eve. Let's make this current day. Press Tab to move to the Genre text field and type Fantasy slash Drama slash Comedy. Press Tab to move to the Place text. The place describes where this story takes place. It can be general, such as somewhere in Asia, or specific, such as in a submarine under the polar ice cap. Since this story takes place in and around Hollywood, type Southern California. The next topic is Format. Click on the pop-up list to see the various forms you might want the finished work to be in. Since we're not sure what the final work will be, let's leave it as general prose. The next topic is the Comments field, where you may add comments about the project. Type, not sure what this will end up as, but might be fun as a movie or a novel. The next topic is the source material field, where you may note any sources you've used for the project. Type Hansel and Gretel Fairy Tale by Brothers Grimm. Press Tab twice to move to the overall story throughline synopsis text field and type Modern Day Hansel and Gretel could get lost in Hollywood and use their wits to survive the lure of the entertainment industry. Press Tab twice to move to the Relationship Throughline Synopsis text field and type Hansel is the vain, older, more gullible brother. Gretel is the younger, sharper sister. Now it's time to import some pictures for the overall story and relationship through lines. Even though we do not ship sample pictures to import, follow along so you can see how the process works. To import a picture for the overall story through line, click on the Import button beneath the default Overall Story image. I've preloaded a folder with pictures for this project and copied it into my Dramatica Story Expert Documents folder. If I open the Hansel and Gretel Pictures folder, I can select the Walk of Fame JPEG file. Now I have an image that better represents Hansel and Gretel's trip through Hollywood. To import a picture for the relationship through line, click on the Import button beneath the default relationship image. I'll choose the Hansel and Gretel JPEG file from the same folder. It's important to note that Dramatica Story Expert supports a great number of image file formats, such as JPEG, GIF, PNG, TIFF, PSD, BMP, and more. Click on the Overview icon to switch back to the Project Overview window. Notice that the pictures and additional information you added while in the Story Info window automatically populates the corresponding text fields in the Project Overview window. Use File Save to save the file if you wish to continue using this example for the next tutorial section, Creating Characters. This completes the Using the Story Info window tutorial.